Hi, I'm Arthur. And I'm Andrea. And we are Heavy, Heavy Metal, Metal Beer, Beer Club. And today we're tasting Oktoberfest from Firestone Walker Brewing Company. And they're out of Paso Robles, California, so please stick around. Music! <laughs> And it is Oktoberfest, O-A-K, because it's an oak-aged lager. It's lagered in French oak barrels from a premium uh, Cabernet wine barrels. Cabernet? Cabernet. Mm. Which, oh, Caber oh, the Cabernet wines. Well, the wines, all the wines from Napa Valley are amazing. Ooh, yeah. Did I say Napa Valley? Ooh. Firestone wines are really good. I haven't seen them for a long time, but... They're very good wines. Absolutely, and uh, give it that really nice. I don't nice even know if they festive, sell them anymore. Festive labeling on it. Yeah. Now let's pop this bad boy open. All uh, things Oktoberfest, and it's a play on the Marksen beers. Yeah, it's their version of the uh, Marksen beers, and it's a 5.2 percent alcohol by volume. What they always say is beer before glory, <laughs> and it <laughs> says that inside the cap. Kind of fun. Yes, excited about these Oktoberfest beers that are coming out. It smells so good. It smells like a cookie. Yeah, it's uh, just very traditional scent to it. Mm -hmm. It's. Uh, it, golden, I smell a lot of hops in it. Golden amber color. For a Martin, it's it's. I can really smell a lot of hops. Yeah, very clear. Yeah, clear. Wow, look at that. Clear that and does clean. Look very nice. Clean as a bell. Clean yeah. as a whistle. Very clean. In my prediction is probably very clean tasting this I have never had it before but she is uh, I have had it, had it at one of the I drink it houses all here. the time yeah. <laughs> I did have it at a, at a tap house here in town and it's very good let's taste this monkey it's got a, a light mouthfeel yeah medium me oh uh, yeah light to medium yeah, mouthfeel light, light to medium that is very, very nice. it's very crisp and you know I'm not really into a lot of the traditional tasty yeah. beers, but this, I really oh, like yeah. the flavor of this. This is very nice. Oh, yeah. It's biscuity. Yeah. It's definitely an Oktoberfest beer. I, I love would, it. I would even say slightly sweet. I wouldn't call it a sweet beer, but I think it has some sweetness to it. It's biscuity with maybe a little bit of uh, spice on it. Little biscuits and spice and whatnot. It's very good. I love it. Yeah, it is really Super good. Super good. I drink this anytime. If I see this at a tap house, I would definitely order it. No. Try it if you look for this beer. And you were telling me that it uh, it didn't have because I, I expect I see oak aged, and I because I love oak aged barrel right. barrel aged beers. You don't. You can't taste. I don't taste the wine, of course, from the wine barrel, but no. it, you can. It does taste oaky, so you get that woodsy taste in it, which is very very nice very good it's a clean crisp beer um, even people that don't want to venture out from their uh, usual Pilsners you know or a Budweiser or something like that they might be interested in this because oh, it's not heavy I think this would appeal to a, a large amount of different tastes if you're just getting into craft beer try a Martzen you know that could easier ease you into some new things that you haven't tried before what are you guys doing for Oktoberfest? Are you going to make some brats and kraut and whatnot? What are you doing? What's Which Jack Skellington have to say? He's come out for this occasion, this momentous occasion, because his time of year is here, which is my time of year, no doubt. And if you like this sort of content, just fun beer tastings, please hit the like and subscribe button. And thank you for those who have been supporting and also watching yeah. on a regular basis. Thanks We've for your support. We appreciate it. And on the tasting meter, which is a scale of one through five, on what the, would you say? On the tasting meter, I'd give this a, a 4.5. It's very good. And I'd go with a solid four. He'll, he'll give it a solid. A solid four. <laughs> Do me a solid. That always cracks me up when people say that. And thank you so much for joining us here at Heavy Metal Beer Club. Cheers to you. Stay safe, drink responsibly, and, and don't, don't forget, forget to stay metal. Shall we give it a couple minutes to allow mine to nah. defoam a little bit? No. 
Ooh, it smells so good. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. Gosh, what's the, what's the, there was, there was the wording that I liked better. It's lagered in French oak barrels from a premium Napa Valley Cabernet. 